talk a little bit about, since we sort of touched on education, and talk a little bit about um, public relations education. Um, now, you found yourself as a teacher in the classroom, university level. Um, we talked earlier when we were at, at lunch about how important that was, or how important it is to you. Um, do you believe that recent graduates are prepared for the informed ethical decision making that they're going to face in today's world? Mm. I'm going to put my foot in it now. It depends on the attitude of the student and the attitude of the teacher. If the attitudes are, and the thought process is, that this is something mechanical, like mathematics or bricklaying, um, I fear for the future. Um, uh, if, if this is seen as something um, that is, uh, has a life unto itself, that's going to go wrong. What public relations is really about is supporting the best things, backing, pushing, helping the best that is in society. Um, and making its practitioners feel great as well as rich, but first great, uh, and making the best causes survive and prosper. By causes, I mean automobiles or donations to the Red Cross or whatever the product may be. Um, I think a lot about this because I've been in the classroom. and, and uh, uh, the young people are like the population of the of the country. Some are this way, some are that way, some are tall, some are short. Um, I I don't find enough um, spirit, for want of a better word. This is not a very academic word to use, perhaps, but spirit. I don't find enough spirit there. Um, and spirit is what's needed, uh, as well as technology. I think that the uh, uh, history shows that the great uh, PR people have been those with spirit, who've, who've dared to do something, who've um, taken on difficult problems and solved them. Um, I think that anybody can make a work-a-day uh, livelihood out of uh, in the PR field by doing this, that, or the other thing, being very good at uh, audiovisuals or knowing how to write a press release. Or, but those who will really enjoy life and have fun with it and contribute something positive and useful to society are those who will be fired up by the notion of persuading for good, persuading positively, persuading to make something good happen. Whether it's uh, to buy Hershey bars or, or, or not to eat too many chocolates. It's a wonderful um, profession. Um, So there's that spirit of, that, that, that quality of, of, of having spirit. Are there any other qualities? What other qualities will make a, a good PR? A good PR person will be someone who's very curious about things, who wants to learn. Why did she do that? Why did he do that? Why do people do that? And having learned why, then you know how to change their direction, if it should be changed. Um, why do they do that? Uh, then what makes so-and-so tick? 
what what makes uh, Chinese people open restaurants in the United States? Why are there so many Chinese restaurants and no Chinese farmers? Why? Why? Why is why is this? Why is that? That's the 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 thing that I think. Uh, helps make great PR people. Why do they do that? And because if you understand why they do that, then you know how to alter that, to change it. Um, I think that uh, PR is dealing with the real heart and soul of human beings. Uh, I don't think there can be anything more exciting than that. Uh, and I think that uh, that those who, who see that and who sense that have a great pleasure in following this path of this career of PR.